Hey everybody, Briquet here showing the locations of all 17 Rex Fury silver statues and three character tokens in LEGO City Undercover. Thanks to Jack123 Stop On, Nitrous Clips, and Jack Gaming for requesting it. The Rex Fury silver statue in Cherry Tree Hills is up that winding road at the top of the stairs. I highly recommend getting the unlimited dynamite red brick before destroying all these silver statues. But if you're not ready for that yet, I'll show you where there's a dynamite vending machine near each silver statue. <laughs> I think it's so funny that they have those in this game. <laughs> I try to get away from the explosion so I don't die and lose studs. get some dynamite at the Auburn train station for the silver statue on the bridge. See the description below this video for the times of the Rex Fury silver statues if you want to skip right to them. Also there's a link to my five most useful collectibles video with the unlimited dynamite red brick in it. Police business. Also I'll put a card in the top right corner of this video that you can click on for that video. <laughs> I tried to drive through there. <laughs> I was wondering why they don't consider this the Auburn Bay Bridge silver statue. But I guess the bridge doesn't officially start until you're over the water, which makes sense, I guess. <laughs> but it looks like the bridge on the map. Wow, that was a high jump. It doesn't always work that great. <laughs> I blew up anyway. get dynamite by the diner in Fort Meadows. I haven't built the train station in Fort Meadows in this game because I wanted to keep the Cydonia, the red train. Once you build the last train station, the Cydonia gets replaced by the Emerald Knight, which is a great looking train too, but I have that in another saved game. I want a fast car. <laughs> this is an emergency. If you have a performance car or emergency vehicle, or if you have the nitrous for all red brick, you can go faster by holding the left button until the tank empties out. Then drive until the tank fills up again. Then rinse and repeat. There's a crash map super build next to the silver statue in Fort Meadows, which costs 10,000 studs. So you might want to make sure you have enough bricks to build it before you go up there. We need to get on top of this second house. If you don't have the jetpack, you can go all the way down to the last house and get up there with the farmer disguise. There's the crash mat super build. I had to speed this up because it takes so long to get across. <laughs> I'd like to give a shout out to my new five-year-old viewer, Henry, and his dad, Barka1999. Thanks for watching. The emergency crash mat super build costs 10,000 studs. And we get the slicker worker vehicle token. The next silver statue is in Bluebell National Park. There's a dynamite vending machine over here, which you might have to come back for for the statue. You'll need the first stick of dynamite to blow up these silver rocks. I didn't want to get blown up again. 
<laughs> Switch to the police disguise or you can jetpack up there. Ooh, I'm too close. I'm gonna get blown up. <laughs> Before you go to Uptown, you can get some more dynamite here. I'll show you where you can get some in Uptown, too. That's where the silver statue is. And the dynamite vending machine is on the second floor of that building with the red awnings. Sorry, police business. The uptown silver statue is up there on the right. The dynamite vending machine is up there. What's going on? Wow. It looks like we need the jetpack here. Go back to that building to get more dynamite for the Crescent Park silver statue. Hey, how's things? The silver statue in Crescent Park is on that black circle, which I didn't center very well. <laughs> uh oh. Hmm. I guess I could have cut through there. <laughs> get Maximilian Jarvik just for going up here. Here's another place to get dynamite by the giant coffee cup. But for the Bright Lights Plaza Silver Statue, this one is closer. We need the police disguise for this. This part is so slow, I just had to speed it up. I love the sound of those studs. Hit the right button, and then hit it again. We can get more dynamite here for the Pagoda Silver Statue, too. It's pretty close.
we can get some dynamite at the hospital in Festival Square for the Heritage Bridge silver statue. Whoa! Just missed him. Good thing this is just a game. <laughs> or I could have taken the train to here. This is just to get some dynamite. If you already have some, you can just go over to the Heritage Bridge. We can jetpack up here or take the elevator. I tried going down the elevator, but it wouldn't go down. Maybe because I didn't use it to go up. Now I'm going to the Heritage Bridge Silver Statue. <laughs> I guess we need the jetpack for this too. That jetpack is so useful in this game. You get it in Chapter 13 of the story. where I am on the bridge. The one downtown is on the southwest pier. Ouch! Sorry, it's an emergency! Sure, that's what you always say. The dynamite vending machine is in here, so if you don't need it, you can fast forward a little bit. We're on the southwest pier downtown for the silver statue, and that's where we got the dynamite. to Lady Liberty Island from the flat side of this building. We can also get a helicopter and tag the car for the time trial, if it's there, or jump into a boat nearby. Oh look, there's a coffee break right there. <laughs> huh? Up. Another day, another eight hours of glorious work. I'm getting far away this time. We're right in the middle of the island. Trying to select the train station under this disguise booth is the worst. 
This is just for the dynamite vending machine. Now I'm going to get the King's Court Silver Statue and the Ezra Baxter Character Token. part's really scary. I almost fell off there. This is very slippery. I'll have to use the ladder. <laughs> While I'm up here, I might as well get Ezra Baxter. In past videos, I went to Apollo Island from the ferry in King's Court, but I forgot to this time. So I'll get that one after the airport one. Here's where we can get some dynamite. What's up? What's up? I just recently showed where the dynamite and the silver statue is in Fresco in my Fresco character video. <laughs> The dynamite vending machine in Paradise Sands is at the pier. The silver statue is right across the street from it. Man. Got out of the way just in time. <laughs> There's a dynamite vending machine right here in front of the airport terminal. And the Rex Fury silver statue at the airport is right by the train station. It's been in most of my other challenge videos. You might have seen it. <laughs> Police business! I could have just run over there, but I like this car. And now I have something to drive to the statue. <laughs> I stayed up so late. Hey! Look oh. where you're going! <laughs> <laughs> That's not a Lego tree. Huh? 
Now we'll go back to King's Court so I can get to Apollo Island's silver statue. I like how he flies out of there. Uh -oh. There's a dynamite vending machine behind those stairs. this works without the jetpack. Sometimes it's hard even with the jetpack. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> We get to Albatross Island from the ferry in Cherry Tree Hills behind the police station. You can get some dynamite behind this train station if you want before we go to Albatross Island for the silver statue at the prison. Or you can get the dynamite on the way to the silver statue. We pass right by it anyway. to the Isle of Villains. If you don't have the jetpack yet, you can get to the top of that roof if you have the farmer by going up to the top of that tower and chicken gliding over to the roof. I hear a kitty! <laughs> Switch to the miner to buy some dynamite. Then grab it. Oh, I got some blue studs by jumping an extra time. <laughs> right there is the free run that you can unlock if you want. Since we destroyed all 17 silver statues, we get the Mine Foreman character token and, of course, another gold brick. <laughs> That's another job checked off the list, Chase. Well done. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button, which I really appreciate, and subscribe to see when I upload new videos. And I'll see you next time.